finish this in class. All right. Um, so that I want to make sure everyone's done. Um, this is drawn like a protractor and a protractor add up to 180 degrees, which is also we call a line. So you take that, okay, you have this um, angle here, right here, that's x, that's 3x minus 60, and this other angle right here is x, so we plus that x, and that add up to 180 degrees, okay? That gets you 4x minus 60 equals 180 degrees. Add 60, add 60, you get 4x equals to 240 degrees. Divided by 4, divided by 4, x is 60. So this de degree right here is 60, okay? Or in this way, 60, you can put it here, minus 60 is 100, and that's 180, so that's 120, because 120 plus 60, if you add these two together right there, you get 180, okay? So after that, you need to do vertical angles. Right here, vertical angles are congruent. That's 60. Okay. Right here, you take it, oh, take that, notice these two are the same, vertical angles are congruent, 120 degrees, and the other one's 20, okay? So, alternate interior, this is 60, alternate interior, the inside here is also 60. And then vertical angles, 60, and here is that 120 degrees, okay? These two sides are congruent, okay? Alternate exterior, this is an alternate exterior angle. Exterior, they're congruent. That's why I have the congruent sign here. So these two are congruent. Okay, so you minus 28, minus 28, it's 102 to divide by 2. X is um, 51. You don't have to need to find the angles. You shouldn't be able to know that that's 130. This is also 130. That's what X would be. 51, add it, and you get that. And this is 130. And then you can put the rest in, right? Uh, my main worry is... Um, this is 50, 50, 50, 50. Um, is, so you can put 140. If that's 140, this is also 140. And this one is 40 degrees, right? 40, 40. And this is 140. 140. That's easy because you have the degree there. But what we want to find what x is. For these problems, I want you to solve for x. So this is congruent, okay? Those two angles are congruent. So you set 5x plus 5 equals to 140. Minus 5 minus 5. 5x equals to 135. Divide by 5 x equals to 20. 
um, three. 23. No, more than that. 27. Right? So it goes to 2, 10, yeah, 27 degrees. So x is 27. That's what x is. Okay, so you don't have to put the angles, I just need you to solve for x here. Okay, those are congruent. So you set it up equal to each other. All right, congruent sign, and, and we just get rid of this squiggly line on top as we solve. U minus 2x minus 2x. That's 0. That's 88 equals to 2x plus 6. Minus 6 minus 6. That's 0. 2x equals to 82. Divide by 2, 41 equals 2x. So x is 41 degrees. Okay, we're solving for x. So here, this is alternate interior. So we know they are congruent, right? Alternate interior, they are congruent. So set it up where they're congruent. 5x plus 10 equals to 2x plus 10, 100. <coughs> Not equal to, but congruent to. They are congruent to. So minus 2x minus 2x. That's 0. That's 10. Oh no, that's not 0. Sorry, that's 3x plus 10 equals to 0 plus 100 is 100. Minus 10 minus 10. We get 3x equals to 90. Divide by 3, divide by 3. x equals to 30. So x is 30 plus 10, <laughs> it's 160 degrees. That's incorrect. Not to scale, guys, not to grit. You're not supposed to find a degree. All I wanted to do on these problems was solve for x. Okay, so these two are congruent because they are congruent. You put 2x minus 30 is congruent to x plus 133 minus x minus x 0 x minus 30 equals to 133 add 30 add 30 x equals to 163 if you add it the degree is more we're not we're not solving it to put in the problem, okay? We're just doing the math. I don't know. I wasn't thinking. It doesn't even make sense. But you're solving for x. This add up to 180. Notice that makes a straight line here, a protractor, which is 180. Okay? So, here you get 3x minus 15 no plus because it's a protractor they add together to make 180 so add 2x plus 5 equals to 180 combine like terms these together okay you get 5x plus 5 plus negative 10 actually negative 10 equals to 180 Add 10, add 10, okay, 5x equals to 190, divide by 5, x equals to two, two, 3, 15, 48, 38, 38, and if you put it in, that would make more sense, I did that one, the degree looks more accurate, okay, this is like a protractor, you add them together, makes 180 degrees. So 2x plus x plus 3 equals to 180. Combine this like term. 3x plus 3 equals to 180. Minus 3, minus 3. 
3x equals to 170. 7 divided by 3 goes in 5, 5 to 9, 59 degrees. Yeah, that makes sense. X is 59 degrees. Okay? You don't have to fill in the, the degrees. I just want you to find X for this page. Okay. So this is 4x minus 20. So if you look at it like that, these two are congruent. Alternate interior is congruent. Vertical angles are congruent. So these are congruent. So you set it up as 4x minus 20 is congruent to 3x plus 100. Okay, additive inverse plus a negative minus 3x minus 3x. 0, x plus negative 20 equal, congru equal to 100. Add 20, add 20, x equals to 120. Oh, does not make sense at all. Okay? Way off. But we're solving for x. These two makes 180. Makes a line. 2x plus 2x minus 4 equals 180. So... 4x minus 4 equals 180. Add 4, add 4. 4x equals to um, 184 divided by 4. x equals to 40. 16 remainder 2, 24, 6, 46. That makes more sense. <coughs> okay, and then write down what you learned. That's today's homework. I hope this helped.